Browsing the internet becomes daily life routine. How can it be made easy for us to search for almost everything on the internet? You were mentioning on the importance of the information resources, the powerful search engine, and what we know every time when it comes to a specific search, a web browser. Today, I'm going to share with you guys about 10 things you should know what Google Chrome browser can do for you. Welcome to Take Chaplin, and this is Anafan. Number one, clean up your PC. It's called Chrome Cleanup Tool. You can find this tool by asset to your Chrome settings or click on the menu option on the top right corner of your Chrome browser. Now click on the setting menu button, scroll it down and click on reset and clean up. Here you have two options for either reset the Chrome settings or clean your computer. Click on Find and Google Chrome will scan your computer to find harmful software and remove that out. This process can also help to remove unwanted ads, pop up ads, and malwares. Number 2 Cut screen to TV or other devices. With Google Chrome, you can choose to cast your laptop screen to your TV or other supported devices. To use the cast screen on Chrome, you can click on the Chrome menu option, then choose to cast. There are three options for casting screen on this feature. You can choose to share the screen of a tab on your Chrome, cast the laptop screen, or stream a video or audio file. This is how screen mirroring from your laptop made easy. Number 3. On-page searching. During the time browsing the website and web pages, you might want to perform some detailed on-page search for quick reference or something. On a specific web page that browses on your Chrome, you can hold on to the Ctrl and F on the computer keyboard to search for details on page. Number 4. Google Chrome Tax Manager Every computer has its tax manager and so does Chrome. There are times when you're browsing on the Chrome and forget about data savings. To do so, you should click on Chrome menu option and choose Tax Manager. The Google Chrome Tax Manager helps you to understand how many tabs are currently running on your Chrome and tells you when you need to save your data usage. Number 5. Organizing your bookmarks When browsing the internet, you might want to bookmark those website links and addresses that their contents are useful to you. Google Chrome has a bookmark bar for that. But what you need to do is getting a better bookmarking behavior by creating new bookmark folders or categorize your bookmarks. This can be done under the bookmark manager. Number 6. Quick translate anything. With Google Chrome, you can choose to on-page translation to different languages. To do so, just install the Google Translate Chrome extension first. Once you enable the extension on Chrome, you now can translate any pages to your preferred language. Number 7. Manage Search Engine This feature will allow you to choose which search engine that you want to use on every of your web search. The default search engine is set for Google. If you want to make any changes from this, you can go to Chrome menu options. Go to settings and choose search engine. You can add more search engines upon your choice. Number 8. On Startup Page On Startup Page is a Chrome setting that lets you open a specific website at the time of starting your browser. To pin this website on Startup in Chrome, just go to Chrome menu option, then choose settings. In the setting menu, navigate to on startup page and add the website URL here. Number 9. Choosing where to save your downloaded file from Google Chrome. Chrome will let you choose the location on your computer where you want to save your download files. Just go into Chrome settings, then choose advanced. Here you can see the setting for download files. 
clicking on the chain will let you choose the specific location for the files. Remember to do this before you even try to download any files. Number 10. System settings for saving data. Apart from using Tax Manager to know the data uses on Chrome, user can also have an option for saving browsing data from system settings. On your Google Chrome, navigate to Chrome settings and choose system settings. Make sure you turn on both of the buttons for the options mentioned here. Some of the times, switch off the use where acceleration button is very useful when it has the chrome flickering screen problem. Now I've walked you through the 10 cool features on Google Chrome. Hopefully after this video, you can apply more tips on using your Google Chrome during the time browsing or web searching there. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you like it, please give it a thumbs up and leave a comment on the comment section down below. Again, thank you so much for watching this video and hopefully we will see you on the next video. Goodbye for now.